Com. Well, we still haven't hit peak flu season and the virus is killing children around the country. Right here in Alabama, the number of cases continues to grow. However, the Mobile County Health Department says the county still has the lowest number of cases in the state. NBC 15's Muriel Bailey joins us now live. Muriel, even with the low numbers, we are still not in the clear. Exactly. Kim Mobile County has the lowest numbers in the state right now, but the numbers are climbing here. And as Mardi Gras season approaches, officials warn it could get worse. Schools are closing across the state due to students with the flu like symptoms. Thursday, four Mobile schools in North Alabama closed. Yet, so far in Mobile County, we've only had one in Chickasaw. So far, we are still well below the rest of the state. The Alabama Department of Public Health's latest flu report says seven of eight districts are reporting significant activity. Jefferson is the highest at 9.3 percent, while Mobile is the lowest at three. Mark Bryant with the Mobile County Health Department says they credit the low numbers to you taking action. We like to think of as people in Mobile were smart enough to go ahead and get their flu shots. Mobile is not out of the woods just yet because the numbers are climbing and medical professionals warn Mardi Gras season could send it into high gear. I guess the exposure, being exposed to so many different um, people that may or may not have been vaccinated. You're going to have people, you know, at parades, sneezing, coughing, uh, touching the police barricades. The health department's urgent care issues about 50 to 75 flu shots a week, and it's open until 930 each night. Nurses say you still have time to get vaccinated. Reduces hospitalizations and also deaths. So it's very important that they come and, and get vaccinated. And medical experts say the height of flu season last year here in Mobile County was actually the last week of February. Reporting live in Mobile, Muriel Bailey, NBC.